There's work for us here. Where's that apple-pated hick when I need him? Not you, sir. Good day, madam. Well, if it isn't the Vanisher who killed the beast. Bless your heart, sir. You've saved us all. You're welcome, Mrs. Miss, Miss Edith Keane. Is there anything I can do for you, sir? Is all well, Miss Keane? All is well indeed, sir. In fact, a miracle has happened. With the beast dead, my garden has at last begun to grow. With work and luck and God's good grace, we'll end up with a harvest. Though I confess, I find the work more tiring than usual. That's because she's haunted. Thank you for sharing so frankly, Miss Keane. But the reason I ask is... It's delicate. I think you're likely haunted. <laughs> no, that's just my twin brother. I can't get rid of him because we're family. Oh, wait, you're serious? Haunted? Who'd haunt the likes of me? Who do you think it might be? Oh, no. My brother, Daniel. My brother Daniel went for a walk in the woods. So Daniel Keane went missing in the woods, and Edith here is only getting worried now. How long has your brother been missing? And where might he be? You worry me, sir. With the beast gone, Daniel dared to walk the woods. I did not. Who knows what still lurks out there? I swear at times I hear voices rippling in the trees. Please, would you find him? Better late than never, I guess. I'll look into it. First, I'll need to have a look around here. Please do. I must go. Find my brother. Please. A meagre crop. At least it's growing. From the desert, by our hands, the Lord has made a garden. It's rotten, all of it. Can't eat that. The devil has wrought his evil here. Traces of a ghost's memory resonate here. Look, a chest. Well, open it, Jobbano. Is it a map? Could it be a treasure map? Let me see. Give it here. So, a treasure map. She knew but didn't tell us. That's suspicious. These tools have seen some service. The Keens aren't lazy. Well, what have you heard? So, you found a map? A map, sir? Yes. In the chest you dug up with your brother. That map. How... How do you know that? Mm, banisher. Knowing things is part of the job. This is... improper. Even indecent. It was just a stupid old map. I told Daniel to leave it be. Where did it lead? I don't remember. There was something about the bridge on the Boston Road. I paid it no mind. Then let us find this bridge and see what we can see. I must go. I will wait for you here. The bridge on the Boston Road. There'll be a waterfall somewhere not far away. The 
me. Monster! Oof! How's Bowles, lady? Oh, Mr. McGrath! <laughs> you are a monster. Thank God! I mean, I'm so sorry. Oh, Lord. <sighs> well, I have thoroughly embarrassed myself. Forgive me, if you can. Think nothing of it. How do you know my name? Who doesn't? You slayed the beast, by God's grace. I admit I thought you a charlatan. I told the newsmiths they get nothing for their money. Mistress Evelyn Fitcher, by the way. I'm what passes around here for a physician. Red McCraith, banisher of ghosts and slayer of the terrible beast. How may I help you? I need no help. I just scared myself. These days I'm afraid of my own shadow. I uh, was gathering plants in the woods. I thought it was attacked by a ghost. <laughs> Isn't that ridiculous? She's haunted, clear as day. No, it's not ridiculous, no. If you're haunted, I might be able to help you. I'm not haunted. I just took fright is all. But if you really want to help, when I ran, I dropped my bag. It has my medical equipment and supplies. Could you get it for me? Medical supplies are valuable. A shame to lose them. I'll see what I can do. May God's goodness go with you, if you're serious. I still can't tell if you're a serious man. You are such a good man. Banisher, rebel, finder of lost baggage. And Beetlehead. You forgot Beetlehead. Here in the crevice, Evelyn Fitcher's lost bag. How does she manage to drop it down there?
more as luck in here. Time to work, Banisher.
quick and precise. Well done. and it wants it for I brought more friends. Bridge is down. He can't have crossed. There. A path leads downwards.
Did we miss a few? Watch out! Spectre position! place has been ransacked. Our Mr. Keen, no doubt. When Daniel goes treasure hunting, he is thorough. Oh, 
might be useful. Someone recently raided these chests. Looks like Daniel leaves no stone unturned. Sprung. That was clever of him. I know. Greed makes for poor choices. I had a friend, Jenks, we called him. Good man. Took a job collecting dues for an insurance company. A postman for the blackmail, as it were. Aye, but Jenks stole the money. I suspect Jenks' story does not quite end there. Mm, stabbed in the back and dumped in an alley. Still, he died rich. Wasn't I always?
Footprints. Too deep to miss. They're a little old, but I'm guessing Daniel Keane.
Is it just me or? I felt it too. Miss a few. Don't let that specter get to the corpse. Time for me to shine. I have another insight. Watch out, specter possession. Hope it's worth the trip.
He went down there. Over here. Look. Didn't leave much of him. He wanted the treasure so badly it killed him. Why set out alone? He knew the woods were dangerous. Let's find his tie and ask him. Here's the map. Dare not touch what's mine! Who are you? Antea Duarte. This is my partner. Red McCraith, Daniel. Good to meet you. My sister sent a banisher. Of course. Tell that harpy the treasure is mine. Your sister was worried, and asked Red to find you. That snake? Ha! Don't let her fool you. She slips and slides and hides her sin. She has a talent for it. What sin does she hide? Envy. She covets. As a child, she'd steal. A dolly from a cradle. An apple from a bowl, a cake from off the sill. What she wants, she takes. What she can't, she breaks. But she always dodges the blame. In our mother's belly, someone kicked in our born bruised purple. But Edith smiled and laughed, and no one thought to wonder was she bad. Do you not get along, then? Not now. Not then. If she had listened, I would not have died. Was it she who sent you out into the woods? As good as. As good as, or I'm not Daniel King. And now I'm dead, and she is not. And she must think that she has won. Did you dig all these holes? Aye, I did. And I'd have dug and dug till I'd found the treasure. Wolves came, and I fought them off. Some was theirs, and most was mine. But though soaked in blood, I kept digging. The cold came, and I kept digging. Exhaustion came, and I kept digging. And then, Cold and weary to my bones, the blood pooling in my boots. I could dig no more. I closed my eyes. You dug your own grave. Why would you do that? You ever been poor? Have you broken your back in the fields only to starve when the crop fails? I have, and did not like it. Why should I not eat fine food and wear fine clothes and pay other men to do my work? Why not I? I died for a life worth living, and I'd do it again if it meant my sister Edith would never have the treasure. Why blame your sister? What does she have to do with this? 
This is all her doing. In her envy, she coveted the treasure. I saw it in her eyes. I knew not when the double cross was coming, but I knew it was on its way. So I retaliated first. I crossed her, and the treasure is mine. The treasure is mine! Why would you not share it? I was fair willing to share, but she would not listen to reason. She wanted to use the money to leave. She was wrong. This is where we should be. This is the future. The beast is dead, and the curse is lifted. Life here gets better and will get better yet. We can make our fortunes here. You decided to claim the treasure and force the issue. If I held the money, she'd have no choice but to see sense. But no, I'm dead, and her envy has left her poorer than ever. Time we went. Don't listen to Edith. She lies with every breath. Stubborn, isn't they? He's also a man who holds a grudge. We need to reach out with a sister. Bastard fuck. Can he see a thing in this? Use this one. The spot has to be close. Perhaps you'll... the spot can't be far.
one less to worry about. Don't let that vector get to the court. It's on you. Right. Which way to camp? We'll find it. If you need a breather, we can do it here.
banish it. Do not be fooled, for the woman is a snake. Well, what have you heard? I found him. Oh my. Where is he? Tell her straight. We found his body. No. No. It, it can't be. I don't think she knew. Oh, God. Poor Daniel. How did it happen? He was attacked by wolves. Daniel's ghost haunts you now. Me? How am I to blame? That's interesting. I didn't say you were to blame. I mean, why haunt me if he does not blame me? Well, there are other reasons for a haunting. But his is all about the treasure. He won't let you have it. I should have bloody known. I need to know exactly what happened between you two. Nothing. We did argue at times, but siblings argue, don't they? Aye. It doesn't normally lead to killing unless there's a lot of money involved. What did you argue about? What didn't we argue about? That foolish, obstinate man. I need to go in your house and look through his things. Do you mind? Since when did what I mind matter a moment around here? Do what you must. Look at you, playing the role of the worried sister. They came prepared. Not prepared enough, it seems. It's been digging up gold and digging up worms. I know which I'd choose. Neither seems to have made them rich. Memories from the past linger nearby. In Shaw in Drast, the Toki Min Kurster. It's perfect. He'll never tell the difference. <laughs> you won't cross me, dear brother. Not me. She knew he'd steal the map, so she made a fake. He died because she tricked him. 
I wonder what she'll say when we tell her. What do you want now? Time we went. Aye, it is. through our things, such as they are, and I'll warrant you've learned nothing. Well, I do have more questions. You're very helpful, friendly and amenable. Is it an act? I don't understand. Why would you ask such a thing? I know about your forged map. I know you know why Daniel is missing. How to... Banish a thing, huh? That old fool's greed got him killed, not me. Truly does she love him so. Don't you feel at least a little guilty? No, not a little, not in the least, not at all. I said I'd help you, I keep my word. I'm afraid you must face your brother one last time. Daniel, it's time. Your sister's here. Show yourself. You're not happy. You hear me? The treasure is mine. I see you, Dan. I see your ghost. And you're still mean. The Punisher will see to you. You fool no one, you gold-grubbing harpy. Oh! Not even death could give you manners. Enough! Both of you. I'll have the truth now, if you please. And then I shall decide. I saw your map, Daniel. You were hunting treasure. There's gold out there, and I would stake my claim. This country would have made us rich! Fool, there's nothing here but sticks and stones and mud and rot. At least I was trying to get us out of it, instead of running away and abandoning everything like a coward, like him! Don't you dare say one more word. I'm not like our father. I saw your letter, Edith. You plan to return to Yorkshire? Look around you! This country is cursed! It'll never come to nothing! Life were hard in Yorkshire too, but it were home! And the land there is not cursed! You don't want to go home! You don't want to go back to our old life! You want to go back and buy a large holding and be important! Driven by greed, you went after the treasure alone. You double-crossed your sister. Bastard! Snake! Black-hearted blackguard! Say that again, you ramp! Quiet, the both of you. Oh, this family has two black sheep and they're both utter pains in the ass. Edith, you faked a map and fooled your brother. This is how that ended. You did what? I had no choice. I couldn't trust you, and I were right. You'll not have the treasure, you snake. Nor will you, now that you're dead. You'll not squander it on cursed land like a rustic fool. We'd have been better off in England. You know it, but you would not listen. That choice was not yours to make. The truth is told. Decision time.
Daniel Keane, your presence is harmful and cannot be ignored. Not only do you weaken Edith, but you also ruin her crops. You're a threat, not just to your sister, but to the camp as a whole. Daniel Keane, time to go. Shall I at last go home? If it makes you feel better, then sure. Life to the living, death to the dead. He got all that he deserved. He got all that he deserved. <laughs>